Hello everyone, I am Golden Ashley. I am here to present optimization goals and figures of merits in the course of ad hoc and wireless sensor networks. First of all, uh, for all these sensor networks, scenarios and application types, uh, different uh, form of networking solutions can be found while a general answer appears impossible considering a large variety of possible applications. Here first we are going to see about the co uh, quality of uh, service. So WSN actually differ from other conventional communication networks mainly in the types of uh, service they offer. So these network essentially only move bits from one place to another. Possibly additional requirements about uh, the quality of service are made especially in the context uh, multimedia applications. So. Um, uh, in this actually additional requirements about uh, offer quality of service are made especially in the context of multimedia application right so such quality of uh, service can be regarded as a low level networking device observa observable attribute bandwidth delay jitter uh, backet loss rate right? and the high level are user observable so called a subjective attribute like that um, uh, perceived quality of uh, voice communication or a video transmission. Similar to traditional network, a high level quality of service attributes in WSN highly depend on the applications. First, event detection or reporting probability. Here, uh, what is the probability that an uh, event that actually occurred is not detected or more precisely not reported to an information sink that is interested in such an uh, event for example not reporting a fire alarm to a surveillance station would be so uh, shortcoming so this probability can be depend on or uh, uh, be traded off against the overhead spent in uh, setting up structures in the network uh, uh, that support the reporting of uh, such an event so example routing table or against the run uh, uh, how is it uh, runtime overhead example sampling frequencies so here uh, event classifications here if uh, uh, event are not only to be detected but also be classified the error is classified must be small then even detection delay that means the delay between detection and uh, event th and uh, reporting it to any or all uh, interested uh, sync uh, to be uh, is required to be noted okay then missing report uh, in application that require periodic reporting so the uh, probability of undelivered uh, reports should be small then approximation accuracy so for the function approximation applications um, uh, how it is it uh, what is average uh, average or maximum absolute or relative error with respect to the actual function then tracking accuracy uh, it must be not missed an object to be tracked. So the reporter position should be uh, as close to the real position as possible and the error should be small. Then energy efficiency. Energy is a precise resource uh, in WSN and uh, that energy efficient should therefore make an ev evident optimization goal. So, it is clear that with an uh, um, uh, arbitrary amount of energy, uh, the most of quality of service matrices defined above can be increased almost. It will um, uh, approximation and uh, tracking accuracy are not uh, notable exception as they all depend on the density of the network. So, the uh, actually the term energy efficiency um, is in fact uh, uh, rather an umbrella term for for many different aspect of a system which should be carefully distinguished in the form of actual measurable figures of merit so here uh, some uh, some of the considering aspect or energy per cost uh, correctly received bit so how much energy counting all the sources of uh, energy consumption at all possible intermediate Hopes is spent on average to transmit one bit information from the source 
or to the de destination so this is often useful matrices for periodic monitoring application then energy per reported uh, event so similarly what is the average energy spent to report one event since the same event is sometimes reported from various sources so it is actually us uh, usual to normalize this metric uh, to only the unique event then delay or energy trade off so some applications have uh, a notion of uh, urgent event which can justify and increase the energy investment for uh, speedy reporting of such event next on is scalability so this is the ability to maintain performance characteristics irrespective of the size of the network um is referred as a scalability so it is uh, served uh, served by any construct that require globally consi consistent state such as addressing addresses of uh, addresses or routing table entries that have to be maintained so hence the need to restrict such uh, information is formed by and uh, goes hand uh in ha hand in hand with the resource uh, limitations of sensor nodes especially with respect to memory the need for extreme scalability has a direct consequences uh, for the protocol design so often a penalty in performance or complexity has to be paid for small network then architecture and protocol should be implement appropriate scalability support rather than trying to uh, to be as scalable or po as possible then next one is robustness so wsn should exhibit and um, an uh, appropriate robustness they should not fail just because limited number of nodes run out of energy or because their environment changes these failure have to be compensated by finding for example uh, for finding the other routes if possible this failures have to be compensated for uh, finding the other nodes so a, pre uh, a precise evaluation of robustness is difficult in practice and it depends on mostly on failure models for both nodes and communication links in the network thank you thanks for listening